Hello everyone, I'm back with another great video here at Curry Flow. My name is Lily and today I'll be covering a topic that you have all been requesting for quite some time. Today I'll be reviewing Curry Flow's the list of the top 5 travel destinations in Northern Pakistan and giving you my feedback based on photos and videos of these tourist hotspots. You can read the full article using the link in the description down below. And don't forget to subscribe our channel so that you can see all of my new videos. So here we go, I'm ready. At number one, we have Sakardu Wali, which is also reputed to have one of the highest international airports in the world. Wow. So it's pretty accessible during the warmer months of the year. Sakardu is located pretty close to Pakistan China border, so it's definitely far away from Pakistan's largest and most populous cities. The mountains here definitely look very really grand and very impressive. And you can see a good mixture of rugged mountains and green areas. One area that definitely seemed attractive for me while I was researching Sakardu was Shangri-La. It is so stunning. Almost like a classic painting. Next up, we have the famous Hunza Valley, which became world famous in the 1990s due to the long life enjoyed by the people who live here. A research study done back then claimed that the people of Hunza had the highest average lifespan of any population in the world. That's not surprising at all. Just look at how heavenly this place looks. I would love to visit this valley someday. Again, what I love about Hunza is that it's located near some of the highest mountains in the world, but still has so much picture book greenery. And now here we have Nelum Wali. Again, I'm sorry about my pronunciation, I'll keep saying that. <laughs> It's sad that I'll probably not be able to visit this valley because of it being in Kashmir, which I heard is not really open to foreigners. But from the pictures and videos I've seen of this place, it definitely looks the most pristine. Not the highest mountains when you compare it to places like Sakardu, but it's just so green and heavenly. Personally, I love green mountains with snowy peaks in the backdrop and this place looks as if it was made for me. Just wish I would be able to visit Nalim Bali at least once in my life. Next, we have Naran Kakan. So it says here that Naran Kakan is probably the most accessible valley for much of Pakistan just 10 hours away from Lahore and 5 hours from Islamabad which isn't too bad if you consider how remote these areas are generally so apparently this place has a lot of facilities like good hotels, festivals throughout the air, clean waterfalls definitely a place that would be on my bucket list when I visit Pakistan Wow. Oh. Look at this three tier falls, it is so stunning. And finally we have Swart Wally, which is often advertised as the Switzerland of Pakistan. Now I know uh, now I know that Swart Wally has had a rough recent past with the Taliban taking over the region briefly just a decade or so ago. But the good news is that it's much, much better now and generally consider it safe for everyone. I also read that Swat Wali has Pakistan's best ski resort at Malam Jabba. So you definitely might want to check it out if you're into adventure. Just look at this beautiful wali. It's just miles and miles of beautiful scenery. Also, not to forget, you will love Swat Wali if you're into history because this area has a lot of history. Some of the earliest Buddhist civilizations called this Wali home and this area also left Alexander the Great in O during his conquests to the east. So you have it. 
That's my review of Careflow's list of Northern Pakistan's top travel destinations. Is there any left out from this list? Let me know in the comments down below. As always, don't forget to like this video and subscribe our channel. Until next time, my name is Olive and see you soon.